Our country is one of the most disaster prone areas in the entire Asia Pacific region, which is affecting a huge population, especially the most vulnerable sectors of the community. The impact of this crisis brought off different MSPSS needs. We can see many people suffering with the unmet needs and lack of access to psychosocial services. Early and effective mental health and psychosocial support interventions, such as psychological first aid, will help these affected populations cope with their critical situations and rebuild their lives. It is important that PFA will be part of the overall emergency and disaster response of the nation's societies. PFA is not only intervention. It is also a set of skills which staff and volunteers should have it, especially with respect to response and preparedness plans of all the national societies. In 2021, we set up the Asia Pacific Mental Health and Psychosocial Support Training and Learning Collaborative. With the strong support from the IFRC Asia Pacific Regional Office, Reference Center for Psychosocial Support, and Hong Kong Red Cross Branch, we are able to serve the national societies better in emergency response, capacity building, and knowledge exchange. We cannot be happier seeing new trainers being trained up and ready to go back to the national societies and start rolling out the MHPSS programs. Since 2017, the Hong Kong Red Cross started hosting the Asia Pacific Regional MHPSS trainings and conference. And we are happy to build this platform from the capacity building of our partners in the region. By training more PFA trainers, we are eager to contribute to the movement PFA for All page. The training of trainers on psychological first aid conducted by the Asia Pacific MHPSS Training and Learning Collaborative helped us improve our skills in providing PFA and also the competencies of facilitating PFA trainings in our respective national societies. This PFA training really helps us to learn different methodologies and adult learning techniques to facilitate the trainings in the future. After this training, we will go back in our national society with full confidence and awareness to do many PFA trainings. Thanks to IFRC and Asia Pacific and Hong Kong Red Cross for helping us to participate in this kind of training. We are proud to say that we are now more confident. Skillful. PFA Trainer